What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am out here in a different location. I'm not in Aurora Beach, but I am in my kayak. I got my good friend Sean Lawless behind me. He invited me out here to Destin, Florida. Well, here, I'm not sure exact beach. Now I don't really want to put it on blast just because, you know, this is a good spot he fishes at. He's nice enough to take me out here. So, today we're going to try to target some kingfish. The troll bite has been really dead lately. There has been tarpon sighting, so hopefully you might be able to get a chance to throw one of those bad boys. But we're going to try to get, catch our, our one trigger fish. That's what we're allowed to catch this time of the year. Snappy season does not open until next week, I believe. So we're going to do a little bottom fishing. Maybe we'll be able to catch some uh, mango snap or whatnot. But let's get out there. Let's see if we can catch some fish, guys. I'm pumped. Let's got to catch some bait. First step is to always catch bait. Got my fish finder on. And I'm already marking stuff. I think it's grass though, honestly. But when I catch bait, things I like to use, I have a little pin 2500 slammer. Something a little simple. On a Ninja Dagger 7 foot rod with a number number 4 green head um, with a shiny, uh, shiny wings on it. A Sabiki rig. I like using that. It's my favorite thing to use. The smaller profile I think is better for the Garmentos. So let's get fishing. Made up last night. And I'm gonna put this massive cigar in I caught this morning. First drop I actually caught this bad boy. Hook him right through his nose. Find out where that hook lays. Try not to get fin by these things, because these things got little tiny fins and they hurt. Hook lays about mid-section, so I'm gonna put it right on top. Poke the barb out so it doesn't come out. This is pretty much King Dust, just a wire to hook rig, a little small J hook, and there's a choke hook in the back. So hopefully, the King short strikes it, you won't lose it. I'm gonna try this guy, drift this guy behind me right now with a nice old heat. Loosen that drag up so when he takes it. He can get it. Him to let me use his water snake, which is a trolling motor you put in your Hobie. Which I'm excited to use, you know. Hands free. So I'm going to hook it up to this mad battery, amp, amp power battery. And let's see. Look at that. And three. Look at that, guys. That is sick. <laughs> I like this. Wow. All right, guys. Got a bunch of fish underneath us right now. And I'm going to free line a bait. I got this sand perch, also known as a squirrel fish. I'm gonna drop her down right here. Cause these fish like to swim down. This free line of bait is probably one of the best bait that um best ways to target some big snapper, mango snapper, and bigger fish of that nature. So I got me a 50 pound full carbon leader from Beyond Braid. I'm gonna throw her out here. See if she swims down. See if I get piped by a big fish. He's already swimming down. I thought I was on, but that's just her swimming down. She's probably running from the bait. Yep. Big Sean got, I don't know how big he's on. <clears throat> Bunch of fish following it too. Bunch of fish following him too. Looks like a little amberjack. Yep. 
Little Jack. First amber jack of the year for me. Caught free line this bait. There's a bunch of them down there. Amber jack. All right, buddy, come on. Nice amberjack. He's small. All right, guys, first fish of the day is a little amberjack. I'm not sure if it's a lesser or a greater, so since I don't know, I'm gonna let him go head first. Nice. Yeah. Oh, I'm on. Well, about to be, it was on. He let go. There we go, come on, eat it. Fish on. It's a decent fish. Not sure what it is yet. I think it's another amberjack. Yep, we got another jack. And he just popped off the circle hook, which is a good thing. And had to deal with him. This mother truckers. Smart. He's swimming in my like underneath my kayak. Here we go, I'm on. Ah, <clears throat> oh, that's a good fish. The drags are tighter. I'm not sure what it is though. Uh, is it another jack? Uh, Looks like it's bigger than the last one. Damn, yeah, he is. Oh, get that braid off of there. Oh. Yep, another good, decent jack. Oh. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Look at that trigger fish right there. Look, he's on top. You see him? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Don't hook me. Make sure I got no water on my lens. Jesus. All right, buddy, I'm going to let you go. You're not legal to keep. Pop that hook out. All right, guys. Fish number three or four. I can't remember. It's a decent size amberjack. I am not 100% sure if he's a lesser or greater, but like I said, not 100% of the species. So if it's lesser, I could keep him. But I'm gonna go ahead and call him a greater, so I don't want to be caught with an illegal fish. But beautiful amberjack. Biggest one of the day so far. Let's see if we can get a bigger one. Head first. Bye, Felicia. All right, got a fresh new bait on, guys. New hook. Let's get this guy down there. Throw him away from your kayak so he'll swim down. You put him next to your kayak, he's going to swim underneath the kayak and stay there for shelter. So the best thing to do is actually throw him out and let him swim down and slowly get him in line. And once your line starts peeling off your reel, I mean, it has to go fast. You, just, you, know, you know you got one. Like now? I got one. I got a good one. Pump him up. Oh. What'd you say? Oh yeah. He's coming up. Oh come on. 
Come on, buddy. Starting to come up now. Nice. Nice. We doubled up right now. Ooh. Oh, I thought it was a black snapper. It's a oh, big red snapper. Big boy. Biggest one of the day so far. This guy's a stud. I'm about to use my net on that one. My ego net. Good. Look how fat this guy is. Look at this. Oh. I say he's 26 or so inches. Oh, I got my keeper you did? So. Let's go. <laughs> Make sure my camera, yep, camera got wet. So I'm gonna get that off. This is a very nice snapper, guys. If I were to measure him, he's 27, 28 inches all day. I got that eagle claw bird to prey circle hook in the corner of the mouth. Let's get a nice picture of this guy. I'll hold him up for the camera at least. <clears throat> Look at this beautiful red snapper. Yeah, oh, you got, I got a border. Look at this snapper, guys. A beautiful red snapper. Too bad they're not in season. So I'm gonna let this guy go. But this is what you catch when you free line baits, guys. You need to start doing this on the kayaks and the reefs. It's probably one of the best ways to do it. So, get a quick release this on this guy. And he's gone, straight to the bottom. Didn't have to vent him, which is a beautiful thing. Uh. Look right here right now. We got a strong west wind that just switched. Has lit up, it's blowing about, I'm say, nine to 10 knots, and we probably get like 15 a mile per hour, 70 mile per hour gust. And it's just chopping up this ocean. So you gotta be aware of your wind way out here, man. Especially on the Panhandle East, the west wind usually make it pretty choppy out here. South wind will bring in swells. North wind will lay it down a little bit, but it'll be swells farther out. But it's pretty, pretty gnarly out here right now. No bit, uh, bites on the slow pitch bait. So I'm gonna drop the squid tricks down. I'm all out of live bait. I ran out. This is made by Nomad, and these are snapper and triggerfish hammer this bait all the time. So I'm gonna drop. Ah. Ah. One hit. Oops. Yeah. One hit the jig. One hit the jig. One hit the jig. Please stay recording. Yeah. I hope. Come on up, buddy. <coughs> Woo. Loosen up the jack just a hair so he can pull. Don't want to pull hit. He finally hit the nomad jig. Been jigging that thing for a minute. It's a decent fish. I think it's an amberjack. Yep, another jack with the nomad. You ain't lying. Woo. Ah. All right, guys, this little amberjack smoked that nomad jig on the bottom. Finally caught a fish on it, man. I caught a trigger yesterday on it, but I finally got a decent ammo jack. Like I said, I'm not sure if it's lesser or greater, so I'm gonna let him go. I pop these hooks out. Stop it. <laughs> 